Drones, robot dogs, and AI-enhanced machines are no longer science fiction. They're marching beside soldiers in Beijing's Grand Showcase. For the first time, China's parade is spotlighting not only human personnel, but also advanced uncrewed systems integrated into realistic formations. From stealth drones to robotic quadrupeds, this lineup isn't just ceremonial. It's a glimpse into how the future of defense technology is being imagined. In this video, we'll uncover what's on display, why it matters, and the global signals it sends. The most striking change in this year's event is the elevation of uncrewed systems to center stage. 16 years ago, China introduced drones in its parade for the very first time. Back then, they were relatively simple, single-role machines. Today, they've multiplied in both scale and purpose. According to coverage by South China Morning Post, the upcoming parade will feature a diverse mix. Stealth reconnaissance drones like the GJ-11, loyal wingman models such as the FH-97, and robotic quadrupeds often referred to as robo-beasts. These machines are classified by the PLA as part of its new domain forces, designed to highlight progress in autonomy and artificial intelligence. What makes this moment important is not only the variety of platforms, but also the confidence to display them alongside crude equipment. Analysts suggest some of these models may be static for safety and secrecy reasons. But even in standstill formations, the symbolism is powerful. China is emphasizing that robotic technologies are now considered part of its mainstream capabilities, not experimental projects hidden in the lab. What sets this year's parade apart is not just the number of robotic systems, it's how they're being displayed. The PLA has described the arrangement of its formations as organized according to real combat groupings. That phrase suggests the machines are meant to be seen as integrated within human units, not shown in isolation. Imagine drones conducting surveillance while robotic quadrupeds handle ground tasks, all while human personnel coordinate the bigger picture. The FH-97 drone, often compared to Western loyal wingman projects, could fly in coordination with piloted aircraft, extending their range and offering extra protection. Quadrupedal robots, some of which have been tested carrying supplies and mounting small sensors, represent versatility on the ground. Pairing these machines with human units is about more than spectacle. It illustrates how automation is expected to multiply efficiency and resilience. Even if the systems remain stationary during the parade, the formation itself conveys a narrative that the PLA sees synergy between people and machines as the pathway to future readiness. Beyond the technology, this parade is also about messaging. International attention has sharpened because of who is expected to attend. Leaders from countries aligned with Beijing are likely to be seated front row, while Western representation will be notably absent. This framing positions the parade as both a domestic celebration of progress and a statement to global audiences. On display will not only be drones and robotic systems, but also other cutting-edge equipment. Hypersonic YJ series platforms, early warning aircraft, underwater vehicles, and advanced electronic systems. The range itself is part of the signal. It shows that modernization is broad and covers air, sea, space, and the digital domain. Analysts point out that while some of these platforms are familiar, others may be completely new, offering glimpses of projects that have only been rumored. The overarching message is unmistakable. China is showcasing its intent to lead in the age of intelligent, multi-domain operations, where technology integration takes precedence over sheer numbers. What we've just seen is more than a ceremonial parade. It's a statement about how technology and people are being brought together in entirely new ways. From stealth drones and robotic quadrupeds to integrated formations that hint at tomorrow's doctrine, the message is clear. The future of defense will be shaped by intelligent, interconnected systems. Whether these displays are fully operational or still aspirational, they reveal a vision of change already underway. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more.